hello boys and girls of St Nicholas and everybody else who's listening. Lovely to um, see the sunshine again and I hope you are all well and happy um, in this very strange time. I've got another story for you today um, about what happened after Jesus went up into heaven, the story we heard last week. Um, and this is it. After Jesus had ascended into heaven, the disciples waited and prayed for a sign that the Holy Spirit was with them. One morning, 50 days later, the friends of Jesus met together to pray as usual. Suddenly, the roar of a rushing wind filled the room they were sitting in. Leaping flames touched their heads and they felt that God was very close to them. God had sent his spirit, just as Jesus had promised. They began to speak, but not in their own language, in, language, in languages they had never learned. Praise be to God, they shouted. We are blessed with special gifts from the Lord. And still praising God, they ran out into the street. The sounds of their laughter and happy shouts soon drew a crowd around them. People from many foreign countries had come to Jerusalem for the Jewish festival of Pentecost. They were amazed to hear Jesus' friends talking about God in their own languages. Some people tried to turn it into a joke. These men are drunk, they jeered. That's why they're shouting and talking like this. No, said Peter firmly. We are not drunk. God has sent us his spirit. And now we can tell you about Jesus. Jesus is God's son and you put him to death here in Jerusalem. But God has brought him back to life just as he promised in our holy writings. What must we do? asked the people. They were quite frightened by now. Peter said, ask God to forgive you. Begin a new life. Be baptised in the name of Jesus and God will give you his spirit. He will stay with you always and help you. That day, 3,000 people became Christians. That's our story for today. Hope you've enjoyed it. And in a minute, I will suggest a few um, little activities you can do. Um, and I hope you will stay busy this week and enjoy your week and enjoy thinking perhaps about that story and what it means to us all. Very best wishes to you all and uh, thank you for listening and I'll see you again.